What is happening? What is good on you? Absolute bunch of legends. So what I'm going to do in this video is we are going to cut a object in half in Blender. You can cut any mesh in half, but I'm going to use a little bit more of a complicated geometry mesh kind of thing just to show you a couple of cool things that you can do with this. So let's jump into it. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to delete my camera. So I'm going to go shift A. I'm going to go to mesh and I'm going to look for I trust the old monkey. And then you've got something like this now. So if you click there, we are in front view. So just click X. So we are in front view. So we are looking at the object like this now. Then first thing you want to do is make sure that your monkey is selected. And you're just going to hit tab to go to edit mode. Or what you can do is instead of hitting tab, you can go here to object mode and click there, which allows you to go to edit mode. And let's say you have done this and all the geometry is selected. So if it's highlighted like this, but let's say you make a mistake and you're like, Oh shucks, now I've just clicked there. How do you select all the geometry? If you click on this, it doesn't allow you to select it. And if you do that, it doesn't select all the geometry. All you need to do is just hit A on your keyboard. So boom, and that selects all geometry. Then what you want to do is go to Mesh. So you're going to click here and you're going to click on Bisect. Boom, nothing happens. Don't worry. We will fix that now. Then what you want to do is just zoom out a little bit. If you are too close, if you are in my position, you are fine. Then just drag this to there. Okay, let go of your mouse. Then what you want to do is you want to click here on bisect, bring this up and select all these. So click on it, hold down. So hold down shift and select all of these and make these zero. All right. And then what you want to do is make this zero, which it is already. And this one's zero. And then you want to make this one. Okay, now it cuts it straight down the middle, which is what you want on the X axis. Okay. And then this is where the magic happens. You can click there. Boom, takes half away like that. And if you click outer, it removes both. But if you click this and you uncheck that, it removes that side. And then what you can do is you can fill it. So if I look here, you can see it's open. If you want to close the object up, you just click fill. And it is that easy. So then you can just go, yeah. And now you've got something looking like that now. And then the last thing you can do is you can adjust the Y, which then brings an angle, but then your fill doesn't work. So you can see if I fill it, it won't work. But you can then, if you go here, and you can then adjust this, which brings back more of the objects, which is also pretty cool in a way. So it's just something to keep in mind, or you can just go back to zero like that. And then you can just fill it up and you've got your object looking like this now and it's really it's really that easy to create something like this so yeah hopefully you enjoyed the video make sure you hit the subscribe button and see you in the next video peace